name is Dio Jegede. Let me take you through week two of the project. All right, this is the property, you remember? The one we've been working on to flip. So, uh, I have the guys in, uh, inside doing some work. Uh, so there, might be, there might be some noise in between. But let me show you what has been done in the past two weeks. I think it's going to be like a six to seven weeks project, but we're making good progress. All right, um, follow me. So, uh, we've, you know, it's been painted, as you can see. We've made updates, we've made progress. This is the first painting that has been done. Um, if you remember, if you go back to the one or the beginning of the project, you will see what this place used to look like. The goal is to make it an open floor plan. So, one thing I want you to know is this AC is going to be moved over here so that we can create room for the fan and the, uh, and the lightning. Then, this is where the TV is going to be. So, there's going to be uh, like an electrical box here for the socket going. Um, also, if you remember what this used to be like, you know, there used to be like a shelf and everything right here. We took all that out to create an open concept to make it look very big. And also, right here, sorry, this is a paint, so I'm trying to be careful not to step over it. So, this place is going to be like a shelf where, you know, sometimes maybe you want to have, it's going to be like a shelf all the way down. If you want to have your library, your study, your books, you know, decorations. So, you're going to see this come together, you know, uh, at the end of everything. Like I said, um, this place, you know, uh, actually our contractor gave us a good idea to put a two by two right here. So this is going to look, it's still going to be like open through, but you won't be able to go through this place. Uh, we're going to remove this uh, gas uh, uh, pipe. So the, the two by two is going to go all the way down here. Then this is going to be the work, uh, the work area to cover. it. Um, still, I'll go, I'll go to the room soon, but let me stay on this. This is going to be the dining area. Uh, so open dining concept. If you remember very well, there used to be a door here. If you don't see that, check out the video from the, the past two weeks or week one. So this door has been closed. The door leads to the master suite initially, but we've closed down the door to make room for this place. Um, while I'm still in the kitchen, let me quickly jump here. Now, as you can see what is going on here, this is where we used to have the washer and dryer. But the idea now is to put an island here. On the island, we're gonna have the electric cooktop. So the electric cooktop comes, I think, on this side. Then the shelf comes right here, like the cabinet. So electric uh, cooktop uh, oven is gonna be at the bottom. We're gonna throw away this old relic. You won't believe it. This is a three-in-one. This oven, stove, and uh, dishwasher. So remember, this was a 1947 house. So <laughs> everything is unique. So this is gonna go out. This goes out, and we're gonna put the dishwasher right here. This washer goes right here. Then we are still working on the granite. Um, all the paintings will be done. You know, I think this has been painted once already. Uh, all these are going to be fixed. You know, this is with two. So definitely you're going to see a lot of updates. Uh, also, if you remember, there used to be a door here. The door that goes to where you have the water tank. I'll show you the water tank soon. But yeah, right now, we're able to block it off. We did something good after the year. If you remember, you know, last week, we had a different idea on how we were going to do this, but you know, we got a new concept from uh, one of our very dear uh, friend and wife, <laughs> of the, one of my partners. So she gave us a nice idea uh, on what to do with that room. So I'll take you to that room, but before then, we have to check out the rooms. And this is going to be where the fridge is. So we're going to have uh, all this uh, big fridge is going to be standing here. So I think uh, you, you really need to have that vision of what it's going to look like. It takes a while before you can uh, come together with what we want it to be. Uh, personally, it took me a while to start getting into flips because I normally don't see the vision or how things should come together. But you know, right now I think I'm beginning to have a different mindset. So let me take you through the rooms. Uh, we have our room one and room two. Let me show you the room one first, which is the second bedroom. Uh, this, uh, one of the things we did here was when we ripped up the rug carpets on the floor, we found out that it was real wood. So this saved us some money. We don't have to put another wood. We don't have to put carpets because the wood actually makes it uh, better. We add more value to the property. So this is going to be uh, cleaned up when it's all said and done. Like I said, we are on week two. This is the uh, window that we're going to put here, here, and here. So we're going to change all the windows out. 
Uh, we've already done the first painting, so I looked up in You can't smell it, but if you, if you can see the, the, the room has been painted at one time. This is the closet, so the closet is already uh, looking good. Um, it uh, goes in, 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 into the closet. The closet is looking better right now. So, what is going on right here? Uh, like I said, this is with two, so let's see what comes together by the time we get to week three. I'll be showing you everything on a weekly basis. This is good. This this used to be some old relic uh, thermostat that was here. The house was built in 1947, but our contractor already worked hard. She has already installed the new thermostat that is going to help. And this used to be the only uh, bathroom we have in this house. Uh, we ripped off the, shower, the, the, the wash and basin. This toilet is going to go away. This window is going to go away. There used to be a hole here. This is blocked out. This is the new bathroom, you know, we already, uh, well, we've covered it up because of painting. You can see there's work going on here. Uh, the top is also new. There's some work going on. So hopefully by week three, we'll see how it is. This is going to go away. I'm not sure what this is for, but it's going to go away. And we definitely have a lot of open, uh, we have a lot of uh, cabinets here. So there's cabinets everywhere. Uh, okay, there's cabinets everywhere that uh, is going to be used, you know, if you want your medications and all that, you can store in uh, this uh, place. All right, um, another cabinet area is this. So we got great cabinet here, you know, we got cabinet here. Let me see, oh yeah. So yeah, there's cabinet everywhere, so there's room for you to actually, you know, um, storage. There's also one up, up there. So everything is a large, everything is big in Texas like they say. Alright, this is where you uh this is where you have the AC units. This is definitely gonna be cleaned up. Like I said, this is week two. So let's see how it goes by the time we get to week seven or end of the project. So we we're, we're making progress. Alright, this is the master um bedroom. You can see these are all the uh, windows that we're gonna install in the property. Uh, one thing that uh, you will see that has really changed is the door. Remember there used to be a door here that um, goes out to the kitchen. So, broke down this door, uh, close it up so that the master bedroom is standalone. This is the only access you have to go out. There's also another door right there. If the master, if you want to go up from the master out of the house. So this definitely takes you to uh, the outside of the uh, property. So I think that is good enough for uh, the master. All right, so this is what we did. This is the good part. Remember this was a two bedroom, one bath, and we'll find a way to make it a two bedroom, two bath. That helps to add value to the property. We didn't see this when we started, but last week, like I said, one of my partners, the wife came around, she saw it a different way and we took to our advice. So, um, there used to be a wall right here, as you can see. So the wall was right here, this was just the closet. The whole house was a two bedroom, one bath. So we broke this open and what we did was, once this place is open, where we thought we were going to put the uh, washer and dryer, what we did was we converted, we converted it into a bathroom. So now, we're going to have a standing shower here. The toilet is going to be here. Then you're going to have the sink. Uh, there, the sink where you can brush. There's going to be a nice mirror here. So, this is making progress. Obviously, it added uh, extra cost to what we are doing as a project. I'll walk you through the numbers at the end of the day. I think adding this extra bathroom increased the cost by $4,500. The closet is going to have, uh, we're going to have like a sliding door right here so that, you know, the closet is a little bit separate when you come in into the bathroom. So, this is work in progress. You will see how everything comes around as we get along. So, yeah, things are moving very well. Uh, let me show the sink, oh, no, the, the trash. So, there's a big trash uh, right here. Maybe we can go out there and you can show it. This is where they dump the trash. We've already dumped the first one. So this is the second trash that is coming and along. Next week, next week the idea is we're gonna do the roof. You know, like I said, this is an old house. So not, not this roof. 
<laughs> outside the roof. So this is just a ceiling. So outside the roof, I can take you out to check. You know what? Let me show you what the roof looks like outside. Uh, you know, follow me. Man, guys are cooking. Alright, so <laughs> Alright, so if you if you see the roof, so that's the roof to the uh, garage. The garage is separate from the house. So we're gonna change the roof for the garage. Also gonna change the roof to the main house. Um, because we added the extra uh, bathroom, we have to close the window right here. There was a window here uh, to the laundry room. Oh, I forgot to mention where we're going to put the laundry since we are making amendments. Sorry. So, immediately we created a bathroom here, which we are, we are going to build a wall. So, this wall is going to be here to separate the bathroom, the master bathroom, to be like an open place for nothing. We took down all the trash. If you remember the green room on week one video, you will see what this has turned into. Now, we're going to put this from here. So here, we're going to put a stackable washer and dryer. The washer and dryer will go, you know, stackable. It goes right here. It goes from here to here. So it doesn't block us to have access from the kitchen out to uh, the uh, garage or to the play area. So you still have your room to walk out from uh, the kitchen straight out outside. And uh, the laundry is going to be right there. So my guys are working on it. We'll see how that comes around. And uh, this is just the open area. Maybe by week five, week six, we we'll start seeing updates to the open area. But for now, nothing is going to be done. Because this is like towards the end of the project that we're going to uh, work on that. So to wrap it up, the garage. What we're going to do is take out all the trash, uh, put the sheet drop to make it look good. Clean the door. The door is very old. If you remember from the beginning, I showed you the. Uh, the door and uh, let me show you one more time what the door looks like. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's what we have. So this is the door. I don't want to take it all the way down, but we're gonna take it out maybe towards the end of the project. Put a new door and we're gonna put a sheet rock. So this is sheet rock. We'll put sheet rock to board all the uh, top of uh, the uh, garage to make it look good. So let's see how the project goes. Like I said, that's the dumpster. So everything goes right there to the dumpster. I think uh, it takes, uh, the project is estimated to take six to seven weeks. Uh, so this is week two. Let's see how it goes. I'll keep you guys posted. You know, continue to uh, follow, like, subscribe, share, and uh, let me know what your thoughts are. If there's something you think I can do better, you know, maybe to improve the property, I'm open to ideas. But well, you gotta send me the money to, to make the update. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Uh, bye.